So today's vlog, uh, yeah, I'm sporting the hat today. The hair is in fact getting that bad. But today we're gonna look at why Mash Camp 2021 uh, is a bit of a drag. Home is such a drag. Not that kind of drag. Yeah, because this is kind of a drag. Not that kind of drag. Uh, not that one, no, no. Not that kind of drag either. No, not that kind of one. Just, just watch. So here we go, looking at dragging inside of Master Camp. So I'm just gonna whip up uh, some quick shapes here on screen and some things that overlap as well will be useful. Uh, so in the past, the past couple releases, I think, uh, we've had the dragging function inside of Divide. So in Divide, I think we all know you can come in, you can click on a line and it will basically get rid of whatever you want. Uh, you can also left click and hold and start dragging and now you're getting uh, this drag function. So any line that I cross now will get, uh, in this case, uh, divided or, well, uh, deleted. So for 2021, this dragging uh, functionality has been added to some, some more features. Uh, so first up, let's look at fillet. So we can go into fillet. I've got a quarter inch rad set here. And again, there's that left click and hold that dragging option. And when I cross two corners, it will fillet them. Okay, it even works for internal or external corners. Okay, so there's the dragging functionality inside fillet. Where else? Uh, we've also got it inside of chamfer. So with chamfer, it uh, works exactly the same as fillet does. Uh, internal, external corners, uh, everything works great. So dragging options now available in fillets and chamfer and it's even available in one more place. So if we go into our trim entities, the dragging option is in all three of these, trim one, trim two, and trim three. It is not in auto. Auto obviously works a little bit differently. I don't think that dragging would work so well in auto. Uh, before we go into the other ones, maybe let's just point out how auto works. I know some see the auto button there and they don't ever use it in auto mode because they don't know how to work it. Let's look at this intersection right here. And again, we're in auto mode. So if I left click on this line once and then left click on this line once you see one line is in fact trimmed. Uh, let me just undo that, hop back in. Still in auto mode, I'm gonna left click on this line once, uh, double click on this line now, and notice I get two lines trimmed. So it's, when you're in auto mode, the second click being one click is trim one, the second click being two clicks is trim two. Okay, but back to what we're really talking about here, and that's the drag functionality inside of trim, so it obviously does not work in auto. I'm left clicking and holding right now in auto, it does not work. But if I hop into trim one, left click and hold, there's that dragging option working. So let's do the same thing over here. I'm gonna left click and hold, hit that line, hit that line, there's that same result that we saw previously. So let me just undo that, hop back in, let's go into trim two. And same thing, I'll cross both of these two lines. And keep in mind with trim two, you are crossing the two pieces of geometry where you want to keep them. Okay, so wherever you cross is the things that you want to in fact keep. Uh, you will get prompts like that if you're crossing geometry that won't work for a trim. So keep that in mind as well. And look at that, I can even undo my chamfers. Uh, trim three still works. Um, let me just make some geometry real quick here for trim three. It's a little bit of a, a different one. And with trim three, keep in mind the selection method matters, or not selection method, the selection order. So when you're doing trim three, to get these three to trim, I have to do side, side, and top. Uh, if I do side, top, and side, whoops. If I do side, top, and side, I'll get something uh, kind of not what I'm after. So, so with that, you have to keep that selection method in mind with, with your dragging as well. So dragging works the same way. We're still gonna drag side, side, and then top to get that result. Uh, so those are the new dragging functions inside of Mashcam. We've now got not only divide, which we had in previous versions, but we've now also got fillet, chamfer, and some trimming functions.